Hey guys, welcome back, Modi101 here, and I'm here with Skittles. Hello. And we are back in Intergalactic Discoveries, and I'm I I been busy. Wait, you've been busy? What? Well, that never happened. The funny part is, is that it's actually been two weeks since we recorded this, and I actually did make most of these change like last minute last week. So. <laughs> So, and I kind of talked about this. So, basically, what I did is I set up walls, and there is little walkways back behind. So, a lot of the setup really hasn't changed, yeah. but I just spread stuff out. I so, so, first of all, we have this side over here um, that has all of our tables. So, all of our... our uh, you know, tinkers, our tinkers, crafting, tables, banners. yeah, yeah, just basic stuff. So there's actually nothing back behind this wall, but we can use it when needed. This yeah. one is pretty much, I made a hole for our cobble. So if we need cobble, we got a little go-to right there. Okay. Um, I didn't feel like moving it, Boop. but great, now I just got cobble. You're uh, welcome. And then I, I kind of set up our capacitor banks, and, and I was on here doing this for a while, plus I was working on those crops. So we were actually able to fill up, which is nice. Uh, this is all of like our mechanism and then our AE stuff. I took uh, the ender chest that we had gotten in um, one of the quest rewards. Do you have an ender pouch? Uh, in here. Yep. Okay, so you have the ender pouch? Yeah, it's on my fleet connected, right? Yes, yeah, so the ender... change the colors. No, nope. yeah. so the ender chest is connected to a ME import bus. Ah, uh, so if I ever want to... Okay. Yeah. Well, the nice thing is because I had to do a, a quite a pr pretty decent amount of mining down in the. Um, now I was mostly just looking for what I needed, but so we don't have a ton of ores. But I had to do a lot of mining for the crops, and I would just pick up random stuff. You know, I have a cobble, a dev null, so I wasn't picking that up. But just like sand and dirt, and whatnot, I could just yeah. toss it in my bag from down there, and it put it right in the ME system. Yeah. And then if you actually jump in the ME system and just grab any conduit real quick. It really doesn't matter what uh, you grab because we're not going to put it down. All right. If you hold it in your hand, you can see oh. where uh. where I ran the conduits. I made a uh, painting machine right here. And then um, basically, yeah, so we ran the conduits. So you can kind of see how it comes through here. But then once you take it out of your hand, it looks like the normal thing. I was wondering how you'd got power over here. Yeah, so yeah. That, I assumed that's... it was just hanging out the bottom of the space. Yeah. Nope, you can't even see it from outside. Like, I thought that the the SS Squeakers was just going to have intestines just dropping. That's not a bad idea. Have it murdered. You know what? I never even thought. I was I was thinking about, you know what? When I do all this work, I'm going to take the ears and whiskers off and <gasps> make you cry. Like that. Just no. like that. See? I wanted that reaction. Bad. So. Um, so yeah, you can come back here and you can kind of see just we have power running. And then the nice thing is if we need more room for mechanism, we just break out blocks, run the power lines up, and we're good to go. And then we have this one last area back here, which is completely empty, but this can be yeah. used for something else. <laughs> so I did that. <clears throat> Next thing. Come on down this way. Come on down to come door on. number five. Um, so I... A little bit was in the nether, some of it was underground, um, but I was able... Oh, you did some work in here, too. I was able to finish our crops. The... Marty, look at them. Yeah, I know. I made them. Look. Look. Oh, you made them 10, 10, 10s. Yeah, boy. Wow. I didn't even do that. By the time I had gotten done, because I had to go find... The emerald ore was the biggest headache. <laughs> that sucked. And I, because I was yeah. like, all right, well, I have five of everything else, so I need to find five. And I, yeah. and, and, and basically, this was a situation. I was like, well, you know what? I'll go in the, in the real world. And then I would find like one and they get frustrated. Be like, screw this, I'm going in the nether. Then I go to the <laughs> nether and I find like two. And then I get frustrated. I'd be like, screw this, I'm going <laughs> to the overworld. <laughs> so I finally got those. Uh, you can see that most of them give off nuggets. Yeah. Um, for some reason, the aluminum gives off aluminum <laughs> ore berry. Yeah, that was... <laughs> I was a bit confused when I picked that yeah. up. I was like, what? And then redstone shards, lapis shards, and quartz shards are kind of the nugget versions for all of these. So, the nice thing is, from an ore standpoint, um, 
you know, now, I mean, heck, we're getting a lot. I Honestly, when did you do this? Because I don't remember. I think it was, like, last week that I came in and did this. Uh, I did this about two hours ago. Oh, okay. This is this, is this <laughs> afternoon? Okay. Because I didn't want you to come on and see that I'd done it. So I was like, I'm going to do this just before we record. Like, I almost had to do an exam in school. I was like, miss, I can't. I have to go make a surprise. <laughs> Like, he almost ruined my day. I was like, no, miss. No, no, no. No, no, no. Well, the funny part is, is that I was so ungodfully sick in this room from making it. <laughs> because we, all I have is a normal watering can. So I didn't even get, like, the easiness of, like, the, the reinforced watering can, which would have made it go. So not only was I frustrated having to find all the ores... I just got yeah. super frustrated, like, sitting there watering, waiting for them to grow. And then, of course, I had to do the the whole thing where I cross-cropped. So I had to keep changing out what was below this and what piece of this was on there and all this stuff. So, all right. I so that I, uh, I came over to the Emmy. Like, I'd, I'd done a couple of them. I think I did two of the rows. And then I was like, you know what? I need a reinforced watering can because it's taking forever. So then I looked, checked, and then I was like... All right, this is easy to make. I made the bedrock you main gets, and I was like, "Oh, we need division to Mhm. So we now have four bedrock you main gets. Sweet. You're yeah, welcome. Yeah, we need to it make. It costs uh, four diamond blocks, but whatever. So, anyways, um, okay. I already claimed all my quests, so I'm gonna do a, a whole bunch of uh, opening reward bags real quick. I'd... I haven't claimed mine yet. That's why I did it because I didn't want to put people through that. Wow! 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 My people have to suffer through it. Wow! Wow! You're welcome. Yes, best reward bag. I got a reward bag. Wow! Wow! I got some clippers. Oh! Oh! I got. Oh! I just I just got three wither heads. Wow! Oh! Nice. That is handy. I got nothing. Alright, so I'm gonna put some of this stuff over. Got another reward bag. Oh my god, stop. Yeah, I got a couple of those. Why are you throwing stuff at me? Because I'm full. Then put stuff away. There was one thing that I got there that was really cool that I was like, ooh, what's this? But I don't know why. It was like a little wow. dagger. What was yeah, that? Yeah, I don't know. I put it in the system. Uh, I'm gonna look. A magic bane. Magic bane. Come here, Muddy. No. Stay away from me with your tiny dagger. Ow! God. You withered me, you gave me blindness, and you smacked <laughs> me across the room, you little son of a jerk. <laughs> I like this. It only has 16 gear of ulti, though. Good. You're probably supposed to use it for, like, something specific, and you're just wasting it. Uh, probably. You're the worst, so... All right, so let's take a little book. I need a little refresher on what's in the book. So agricultural crafts, like I said, I got through all of those seeds. Um, I, it wants us to make auto watering. And then, like I said, we need to get a way to get power down to the bedrock because I still need to do the whole capacitor seed setup thing. Oh, yeah. Simple expo wait, exploration. Wait, wait, where's those, where the skeleton skulls? Uh, I put them in the ME system. Oh, it it gave you the head crumbs. Oh, did it? Yeah. That sucks. So that was um, gonna come to us, but yeah, there, there's a couple of mob kill ones that we haven't finished yet. Like we need a bunch of zombie pigmen. We need a bunch of creepers. Um, magma cubes. Slimes. Which which funny part is? Bats for a bat wing. Yeah. Being down in the uh, thing, I did not run across any bats or any uh, slimes. So, and then also if you need slimes, you should just go back on a uh, be happy. Yeah, that doesn't exist anymore. Yeah, but your favorite little island with all the slimes, where they kept coming on your crops. Don't you miss them? There's certain things we don't talk about. Um, mechanism, you seem. To be a pretty decent way through. You only have a few more things looks on here. You do have to make those clumps and the ore shards. Yeah. So yeah, there's that. It it, it does take you know that thing you were showing me? Mm -hmm. I think I do have to make like 
the Tia 5 machines? Nah, I don't know if you have to go that high. Not to get clumps. No, because this, this... I have to make all the different types of them, eventually. I'm pretty sure. Because I'm only 78% of the way through. Like, there's at least another 10 quests in that. Yeah. So I think I'm going to have to make... Everything. Alright, so I'm thinking that we're going to have to pick a place to be our, um... Kind of our launch pad area. Oh yeah, I forgot we got space. Yeah, I am so tired of going to space in mod packs. I'll be dead honest <laughs> with you. So, I haven't been in. I haven't been all year, Morty. Yeah, all, all 2017. All of 2017. Okay, so you haven't been to space in the last 30 days, is what you're telling me. Correct. So I'm thinking in this one over here, the the little pod that's above the um of the uh, Nether portal. I can right. I can maybe take out parts of the ceiling, yeah. and and we can use that to uh, launch our rockets off of our spaceship, which seems kind of counterproductive. <laughs> so, <laughs> it just seems very. Yeah, I'm I'm sorry. I'm I know it's intergalactic discovery. I mean, it's it's the name of the pack, but yeah. <laughs> I like I am so over galactic craft. You have no idea. So, <laughs> all right, so. So, anyways, and then we still have Lunar Landing and Final Frontier uh, that are still locked. So, those are obviously, at least Lunar Landing is going to be a, the space-based one. So, mm. um, and let me see. I want to see something. Wait. Do you have any more of those facades? Uh, not on me. Are they okay. in here? All right. So, to make a dimensional transceiver... I'm going to need an Ender Resonator, which I should be able to do, in theory, if we still have Enderman heads. I need a Ender Crystal, which is going to be an Enderman in a vial and a Vibrant Crystal. I'm just making sure there's nothing space-related I need to do for this. <laughs> yeah. I should be able to do that. Fuse Glass, Electrical Steel. I'm going to start working on making these Dimensional Transceivers. I don't know if they're, in, if they're one of the quests, to be honest with you. Um, it's a dimensional transceiver. It works just like... Oh, it is one of the quests. Uh, it works just like... Um, oh, God, I'm having a complete brain fart right now. <laughs> uh, those... It, it basically transfers liquids, energy, and items wirelessly. Okay. What the hell are those things called that we usually use? I don't remember. Uh, people are people are spamming it in my comment section right now. I know it. <laughs> just wait, just wait, just wait, people. I'll I'll get it. I'll, I mean, it may be at three in the morning while I'm sleeping, and I just sit up in my bed and scream it out. But I'll get it eventually. Oh my god, this how is gonna we, bug the hell out of me. How do we do the the facades? How do you use the pen machine? Okay, so you have the block, right? No, you just need one in there, <clears throat> and then. Well, no, no, you only need one of these because it, it just, that's just what it's going to make it look like. It doesn't okay. actually use them. Um, and basically, you have to have conduit facades, which I don't know okay. if I have any left. I think I was pretty low. Uh, there's one in here. But you, yeah, okay, so you make those. Now, is this what you want the block to look like when it's all said and done? Well, yeah, because it's going to be the spaceship. Okay. So you put that through, and then it'll run through, and then it'll be kind of a mix of the two, and that's what these are that are here. Mm. Okay. So, uh, what the... Oh, my God. I forgot that I forgot. Now I remember that I forgot, but I haven't remembered yet. Oh, God damn it. I, 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 I literally can't. I'm frozen. Because <laughs> I cannot think of what the hell it is. Modi let it go. Oh, god damn it. I'm quite proud of myself for that one. I know, I know my entire comment section is just shocking and <laughs> full with it. Um, I've already forgot what we were even talking about. 
Oh my god, this is so annoying! Being old is awful. Being young kind of sucks too, but I'm just saying. See, you, you want to know the difference between being young and being old is? Uh, Be being old is better than being young because you can kind of do whatever you want. You know, you, you you know you don't have parents telling what you have to do. You know, you can stay out as late as you want. You can stay up as late as you want. You can go do whatever you want, right? The okay. downside of being old is that one, you don't have the energy to do that anymore. And two, half the time you forget about it anyways. <laughs> oh God. So yeah, that that that's I can't think of a better example. So you know, you know, I don't have to go to school tomorrow. I don't have to or the next day that, or that or, is true. or ever again. You know, I mean, I, I could I could stay up as late as I want and sleep in and it does not matter. But I'm still going to pass out at like midnight exhausted. Exhausted from what? I don't know. I changed my pants <laughs> earlier that day and it really took a toll on me. I was going to say I go to school at, I have to be up at like 7 and I what? Still go up at like two. Yeah, well, no, I, I go to bed at like two and I still wake up at seven. But, but no, but that's that's the thing is that like, but you have to. Well, okay, technically, when you're a real adult, you you generally have to get up and go to work, and usually have to yeah. be there at a certain time. So, so I'll I'll admit I I you know that that I'm I'm kind of stuck in between the two worlds. Um, you're the man in the middle. The funny part is, is I still get up at 7 in the morning, by choice, and I'm still working. I work more hours playing a video game than I did all the years that I had a regular job, and, you know, the only difference is, is that I'm wearing a t-shirt and sweatpants, and that's my work uniform. That's really all that's changed. That's true. <clears throat> that night. One thing I never got to do with my other job that I really felt that I was missing out on is at no point in my other job did I ever get get to make fun of some British kid. So, you know, check that. You check got out, so. Yeah, check that. Oh, did I? Yeah. I said I never get, at my old job, I never got to make fun of a British kid. I'm sure you found a way. Uh, there wasn't a whole lot of... 18-year-old British kids, you know, uh, looking for a job at GameStop, so... I do not believe that one bit. In Arizona. Yep, I still don't believe it. Do you, I think that's you... your prime... Uh, that's your prime... Uh, I forgot what the word is. Like, the person you look for for a job. Candidate. Okay, so what? are, are you trying to convince me that... Arizona is a safe haven for English refugees? Yes. Tell me I'm wrong. You're wrong. You're, you're wrong. Uh, I'm looking for another God. Enderman. I'm gonna starve while I do it. <laughs> Alright. Enderpants! Yes. Are you? Not you. I didn't say fluffy pants, I said Enderpants. <laughs> I mean, you never know. No, I do know, because I said it. No, I'm, I'd am i never know. You should know, because it's not what I said. I have to make sure. Oh, you're the worst. So what are you working okay. on? I was trying to be clever, and it did not work. <laughs> what were you trying to do? You know the whole farming system? Uh, I get sick of Mick having to, like, um... Uh, go and right click on each barrel. So I set up item conduits to insert to each of the barrels, extract from this chest, put the conduit facades ar all around it, and it just that stay in the chest. Uh, did you make the chest output? Extract. Or extract the... without a signal? Uh... I'm really hoping that's it because... Oh, look, it's working! Yeah, look at that. I, I, I'm really glad that that worked because I wanted to be able to fix your mistake 
while I wasn't anywhere near your ba near the base. Yeah, but it's still not working for this. The lapis lazuli charges isn't working. For. Did you put input on the barrel for the lapis? I think so. Do you know so? All right, so um, I've been out here this whole episode, which is honestly just right at the end now, and I've done nothing but show what I did off camera and fly around unsuccessfully finding a Enderman. And fix my mistakes. While not at the base. Okay, you know what? I'm going to chalk this up to a solid episode. Yeah, I think that was a good one. And the, ba the bad thing is now I have to teleport home because I'm starving to death. So... That's always good. No. Not In my books it is. Your books are awful. Thank you. Oh, one of these days he's going to get it, people. One of these days he's going to get it. Modi, it's been two weeks. I need you to say it. Nope. M Modi? Nope. I'm not giving you the satisfaction. Okay, after this episode, I'm going back to an old video, and I'm just playing that on repeat. It's not the same. That 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 phrase like breaks down and 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 and. I'm becomes... gonna take it. I'm gonna take what I can get. That sounds awful. All right, guys. So this was kind of a meh episode. It's been two weeks. We got we got to we got to warm up. We didn't want to blow a hammy out, you know, or, <laughs> or or you know, have our Achilles heel snap and hit us in the butt. So yeah, I somehow uh, get like a kidney infection. Like yeah, things. yes. <laughs> Apparently, whenever Skittles messes up with conduit uh, conduits, he gets kidney stones. So that's that's yeah. for him. So. So he's going to go pee that out and scream, um, and I'm going to see if I can find an Enderman's between episodes and fill up this vial. And, oh, i got to make two of them, don't I? Damn it. Anyways, um, <clears throat> kind of, you know, and I still don't remember what the thing I was trying to remember was. I can't even remember what you were trying to remember. The thing that sends power, liquids, and energy around, it's a square, it looks like it has stars inside of it. <coughs> in Minecraft? Yeah, no, 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 no. At Kmart. Damn it. Skittles. Uh, Anyways. That's inside. Shut up. All right, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure you hit that thumbs up. Questions, comments, concerns, put it down in the comments section. If you're watching my view, make sure you go check out Skittles channel down in the description. And while you're there, make sure you hit the thumbs up and the subscribe. Show them some love. Uh, if you want to play, uh, you know, this mod pack or any mod packs from Minecraft um, with your friends or just have a world that's always loaded in, which is very handy, trust us, um, make sure uh, you head over to AMD Game. Use the link down below so they know you're coming from the squad. Use coupon code to save yourself some money. And until the next infuriating episode of Intergalactic Discoveries, Skittles is a butt edition. What are you doing? You said I'm a butt. Well, you are a butt. That's the butt. <coughs> Till the next episode, next episode, guys. I want to thank you guys so much for hanging out, and we'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye.